Hey there folks, it is Rob and I am the Movie Master. Thank you very much for tuning in today for another Horror Collection video and box set review. And that is on the Saw 8 Film Collection. Now, when I first saw this, I was like, you know, it'd be cool to have all the Saw films, I guess, on Blu-ray. The price was actually pretty good. Um, it wasn't too expensive. And I'm like, you know, because I have, I think, Jigsaw on Blu-ray. And then that new Spiral movie, which isn't included in this because this came out before, before that. So I'm like, you know, it would be nice to have all of them on Blu-ray. But then I saw that this includes the DVDs as well. And I already own the DVDs. Now, let's just put this in perspective. This box set, I think it was like 20, maybe 20 some dollars. You get, you get eight films on Blu-ray and eight films on DVD for that price. That is, um, that is actually a pretty damn good deal. Um, I would give the DVDs to, you know, people that want them. That's what I would do. Uh, because I just mainly wanted it for the Blu-rays. But it's it's cool that you get options. You know, that, that, that that's never a, really a bad thing. Um, but the box set itself is pretty standard. Um, it's got the doll there, the Jigsaw doll. Um, I want to play a game. The uh, spine, this is the eight film collection from Lionsgate. On the back, there is the doll once again. <laughs> Even it shows all the titles that are included. So you got Saw 1 through 7, and then Jigsaw. Um, and you can see right here that it says unrated for basically. All of them except for Jigsaw. It says rated R for Jigsaw. So, yeah. So let's take a look at this. Um, they did kind of a Nightmare on Elm Street thing here. And I'm talking about the uh, Blu-ray box set. It's, it's, it's almost the same thing. I should have brought the box set up to do a comparison. But uh, right here, we have... Two movies on one disc. Now, it kind of baffles me that they couldn't just, you know, like, why not... Blu-ray, it's Blu-ray. Why not have them on their own discs? Why not have that? I always call this, like, the lazy way of doing things. So, on disc one, you have Saw and Saw 2. And this is Blu-ray. Disc two, you have Saw... Oh, l l oh, wait. Let me take this back. We have three movies on, on this disc. On disc two, we have Saw 3, Saw 4, and Saw 5 on Blu-ray. Okay. Disc three, we got Saw 6 and Saw the Final Chapter. But Jigsaw gets its own disc, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Jigsaw gets its own Blu-ray. So, yeah, you, the Blu-rays are, it's just, it's so weird that the Blu-rays are just, they just stuff them on one disc. Now, why does Jigsaw get its own Blu-ray? Because it's newer? I don't know. Then we move over to the DVDs, right? Disc one has one movie, and that's the first Saw. Disc two has Saw two and three. Disc 3 has Saw 4 and 5. And then, of course, uh, Disc 4 has Saw 6 and Saw the Final Chapter. And then, of course, Jigsaw gets its own disc. So, look at all these discs. I mean, this is crazy. All these discs that house all eight movies on Blu-ray and DVD. Crazy stuff. But, like I said, for the price... You really cannot beat it. You really cannot beat it. If you want these movies in one collection, 
um, this would be the collection to get because you get options with the DVD and Blu-ray. So, you know, that's that's really, you know, it's not a bad thing. So, that is the Saw 8 film collection. Blu-ray, DVD. What do you guys think of it? Let me know in the comments. And uh, thank you for watching this. I'll be back with more horror collection videos, more box set reviews, uh, more reviews in general. So, hope you enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next one.